storm show. Ay, it's a storm show. It's all good. It's all good. So storm chasers today, we got three members from the cast of All in Hip Hop, which is an up and coming reality series that will be done on Instagram Live. We got Dre P, Trail Love, and Prince Carter. I'm gonna let them introduce themselves, and then we're gonna start talking a little bit about the show. So Dre P, I'm gonna let you go first. What's up, y'all? It's Dre P, Toledo Zone, by way of Atlanta. We in the building. Um, I'm a artist, actor. Um, I look at myself as a mogul in the making. I've been on TV shows. I've been in movies. I got a clothing line. Just, just self sufficient, man. I'm, I'm here. I'm here for the, forever. You know, I'm trying to build a brand and build a name that's gonna change <clears throat> to my family and represent me in Toledo for the rest of my life, man. That is what's up, Trail Love. Introduce yourself to the people. What's up, world? Trail Love here from the south side of Chicago. I'm a rapper. I also do like modeling for street streetwear brands in Chicago. So, you know what I mean? My main focus is chasing this music and also, you know, the new all in hip hop show. You know what I mean? I'm definitely looking to build my name, build my brand, and you know what I mean, collab with other dope people like yourself. So stay tuned. Stay tuned, stay tuned. And Prince Carter, I think they already know who you are, but let the uh, people yeah. more dance. You know, Yo, I man. Hate this. you know I hate this storm. I hate I hate introducing myself. Go for what? it. Let the people know. Just look me up. Look me up. Y'all, y'all find some stuff. Well, I, I'm gonna say I think they remember Prince when he came on the show a while back <laughs> and started spilling all the shit going on oh, over here. Storm, you got me in trouble too. I got you in trouble. You got me in trouble. I don't know, man. I think you got the. <laughs> <laughs> But, but listen, you know, we got Dre P. Trail and Prince here. Now, this series, All in Hip Hop, this is actually going to be EP'd by Nephi, right? Nefeteria? Yes, yes, yes. How did you guys hook up with her? Gosh, well, I've been friends with Nephi for almost 10 years now. So it's it, it was like family coming together. Everything just feels like family coming together, you know? So it, it's it just happened. She said... I said, Nephew, do you want to be a part? She said, yes. Okay, she said yes right away. Yes, right away. She said, anything for you, Prince, so. And then, then, Trell, how were you brought into the show? All right, so um, me and Prince, actually, uh, we met on Clubhouse, and we just, you know, was kicking game, like, every day. And, um, like, just building a rapport. You know, he got in tune with my music. I got in tune with, like, what he was doing. And, you know, we just built that organic connection so it was just like you know once he seen what i was doing and things that i got in the works he was just like yo let, let's let's make something out of it so i was like man say less so now we here now you know what speaking of clubhouse i tried to get in the clubhouse but i just felt like it was everybody talking over each other so i was like i, I ain't gonna be able to do it, it was that's like, it that's it <laughs> yeah the mics away from people you can only have a few voices in them rooms man that's, that's a fact. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's what I'm saying, Dre. I think some of the funniest rooms I saw, though, I think WAC 100 was in one. Uh, I feel like Meek Mill was in one, too, at one point. Yeah. Tiffany had it. So some of them got kind of funny. I ain't going to lie. Yeah. but they get it, it was a lot. It was a you lot. You got to be careful. You definitely got to be careful on that app. You do. You, have to you be do. Careful. <laughs> now, now, Dre, how were you brought into the show? Um, I got introduced to uh, Prince. Through a mutual friend, uh, Bernard Love, man. Uh, Bernard and I, we've been working uh, together since I got in Atlanta when I got on my um, second and third reality show, Bad Girls Club. Bernard did some shoots for uh, me and always been a solid guy. Recommended Prince with this um, platform and this opportunity, man. And I was just, I just seized it, you know. They they needed me and, I, and I, I'm just here to step up to the plate and... Just like Trill said, it's it's a family type of vibe. You know, me and Prince just got acquainted, but it already feel like I known this man <laughs> forever. Yeah, relationship I, I came in through the mutual party is another real solid friendship that I can depend on. So I'm excited to be here, man. That's what's up. Now, in addition to you guys, it's going to be Suzette, Samuel, um, Jalen, Banks, I believe. Yeah. And then is it one more I'm missing? Yes, it's Courtney. 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 Yes. yes, Courtney. Cool, cool. Yes. Yes, Court Court. <laughs> okay. Okay. And it's crazy because I also met her off of Clubhouse as well. Really? Clubhouse, 
it can be a great tool of, you know, connecting individuals. But, um, you know, for the most part, this is, it, it, it's like family. You know, I feel like I've known these individuals for years. So it's beautiful. I love it. Okay, cool. Cool. That's what's up. So tell us a little bit of what we can expect on the show. <sighs> Everything. All things hip hop. From your new hot upcoming talent to legends. Um, and I can announce today that Snoop Dogg and Little Kim have signed on to be one what? of our first guests. Hey. So, yeah. That's tough. <laughs> that's tough. That's that's big. And Little Kim is coming on. So I just got chills just saying that because I'm you guys have no idea, but I'm, I'm, I'm sure Trell and, and, and Dre, of course, know, but this has been something that I've been working on for like almost three or four years now, and we're finally here. So, Well, I'm going to say, man, if you got Snoop to come on, I, I know it's yes, yes. Snoop, <laughs> Snoop ain't a part of no bullshit at all. What? <laughs> it's going to feel like a party, a good old family party, for real, for real. And now, um, I guess either Trill or Dre, you got either one of you guys can answer this. Like, what time will the show be like live? I guess so that people can know. Well, we got different time slots, right? I think oh. with everything, getting everything shot and prepared, and then we're gonna let Prince hit that button and roll it out the right way at the right time and the right day, you know. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> To be exact, to be exact, it will be at eight o'clock every Thursday. Eight o'clock every Thursday. Okay. Okay. Yep. Do we have an official date or we just is it kind of tentative at this point? Got a date. We got, we a, got date. a date. Look, we got a look, date. Look, 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 we got a date. Sure. Sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. June twenty third. June nice. twenty third. And that's nice. actually BT Awards weekend. So we have right. something that we're actually, well, well, I guess I can say that too. Something special is happening in LA. So Ooh. for that weekend, that BT right. Awards weekend. So that's yeah. smart. You got that all going on on look, the same look, weekend. They're okay, very now. smart. Okay, They're very so. smart. <laughs> and that's one thing I learned, Storm, about Prince since I've been working with him, man. You know, he might come across spontaneous, but he he he's a he got a master plan up there. He, like, he always oh, yes, he does. That. It was yeah. already orchestrated, you know. Yes, and I, and I really appreciate that because a lot of people have a lot of ideas and don't know how to organize them. And Princess, man, I can't. I, I can't <laughs> give credit enough. Very professional, very structured, very on point, and he sees it. You you definitely see it in your head, Prince, for real. I appreciate it. I appreciate that. And I, I got to give him this props for that, too, because instead of waiting on somebody, he's just creating. Y'all doing it yourself. Really, we are the content. We do have the power. You see what That's I'm right. saying? So we start to get on Instagram. It gets big. And then before you know it, now you got a big network like, hey, you know, we want to be a part of it. So you, you got to be fine. I will say that, that there is a network who actually want to pick up the show right now as we speak. Nice. But I ain't saying nothing else. Oh, yeah, don't say nothing else. Don't say nothing else. I don't want to mess nothing up. Don't say nothing else. Don't say. I ain't yeah. saying nothing else. You got me in trouble last time. I ain't saying. Yeah, because I pulled up them receipts last time. I wasn't playing. You did. Storm, literally, I got that call the day that the interview actually dropped. I got a call. Yeah. <laughs> like, why you do that interview with that dude? Um, Okay, I think Jalen just dropped in. What's going on, Jalen? What's good? What's Yo! good? What's All up? right. <laughs> Storm Face, Storm this is Jalen Banks. Uh, Jalen, you can go ahead and introduce yourself to the people real quick. What's up? My name is Jalen Banks. I'm 23 years old. You know me. The what do you what do you want to call it? Uh, You're not on Tinder. This is not Tinder. This is not Tinder. Yeah, I'm 23 years old. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know <who> <laughs> Well, he told me to spell like that, so I don't know the same. Like, I'm the, um, you you can tell them a little bit about where they may have known you, where they may have seen you. You know, you ain't seen me nowhere. You just seen me in the shade room. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay, okay. We, we we've seen you with a person who was with a person, though. We we kind of know a little bit. Not not. Um, I'm engaged to well, me and Fallon Pinar together. If y'all know about her. 
Well, yeah, you, you know what? Just come on. I can't. I can't. <laughs> okay. I don't know how to explain it. Like I'm just going. I'm gonna sound bad any any way I say it. Like yeah. <laughs> it, I, I don't think so. I I think it's okay. So 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 Jalen is engaged to Fallon. They you guys already had your baby last year, right? Yes. No okay. Way. Yeah. So baby was born last year. You guys are here in Atlanta. Um, Fallon used to be married to Simon, who is now engaged to Portia. There we go. Wow. Yeah. See, I, I'll put that web together real quick. <laughs> now, now, Jalen, how did you get brought into the cast of uh, All in Hip Hop? Oh, Prince reached out to me. Nice. Uh, I didn't know what it was. I thought it was a scam at first. I was like, oh. uh, <laughs> Shut up. He said scam likely. <laughs> we are in Atlanta. I'm just saying. We just in Atlanta. I was looking, I was like, the hell is this right here? Right, it took me like a day and a half to reply back. I was like, no, nah, I ain't going to do it. And then I started looking them up. Then I think she, so whatever, Chelsea or something sent me another email. Yeah. So I took a shot. And then Prince got on the phone with me. You know, he liked to, he tried to sell me a <laughs> pencil or something. I was like, you know he what? Gonna sell it. <laughs> he going to sell it. I he going to sell it, yeah. I do what I do. Yeah. I do, what I do. <laughs> so I got a question for, for Prince, and then I'm going I'm to circle it back around to Dre, Trill, and then Jalen again. Prince, since this show is going to be on Instagram, is it completely uncensored? Or will you be, you know, adding in the bleeps and this and that? Oh, you know, Instagram has changed drastically. Like, you have to be careful with music, yeah. copyrights, everything. So, we, you know what? We're 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 going to see how this goes. It's, it's, okay. We ain't doing no censoring. I want this thing to be as real and raw and as uncut. You know, just be truthful. Just have a good old time with this. I, I, I like I said, this is family. We're gonna have a great time. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what Instagram gonna do. <laughs> okay, because I because I'm it's interested. Bad, I'm like, yeah, because it is IG, but then you like, man, they they'll IG will ban your ass yes. quick. Yes. Yes. I'm in mean, Instagram. They, they did right that to me now. this morning. You did. You, you, Dre said he in Instagram jail right now. Right now, okay. like I, I, I'm a content creator. I'm, I'm monetized. I'm making money off my reels. It's beautiful, but I found I've been running into. I'm in jail every other month, man. Like wow. Prince said, and I'm just posting, like, my last, uh, reel that got flagged. I was performing at the Monster Car Energy Show, and I didn't have a shirt on. So you see how, like, it's like an automated system, the algorithmic, the way they got it set up, like. The computer will flag if their artificial intelligence will yeah. flag whatever. Oh, happens. okay. And it takes forever for somebody to reach out or for you to get in contact with somebody and they just put you in jail for 30 days. So I get out May 22nd, baby. Thank you. <laughs> Free him. <laughs> Free that man. I'm, I'm trying to figure out how you got flagged for that, but Kendall Jenner can be naked on IG. Exactly. You know, you know what's so crazy? Me and Fallon, we made, uh, you know, we did that nude photo of me and her for a book cover. They flagged me because we didn't have a shirt on. Her chest was on my chest. Wow. Mine was on her facing each other. They flagged me but left hers on there. I'm like, what the hell? Yeah, that like, they out. I was like, it's it weird. Make, it don't. They flagged me this morning, so I can't post no more. What did they flag you for, Brent? Wow. I just posted an article, and they, <laughs> they, they, I posted an article, and they just flagged me. Damn, right. this morning. <laughs> See, that's why I be on Twitter. I put all my debauchery shit on oh Twitter. Don't have to worry about that. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's why you go to Twitter. Pay per view. <laughs> right, pay per view. Right, right. PPV. So, um, <laughs> damn, I just thought about something else too, but never mind. It's gonna be on Instagram. I was like, y'all could have low key even did like what they did on uh Bad Girls and put it on OnlyFans. Y'all could have did that too. Now that I think about OnlyFans? it, OnlyFans. Because that's how they started Storm. before they got to Zeus. Storm, you trying to get a producer credit? Yeah, but I'm you know, it, it sounds like you started. <laughs> I I'm not in it. I'm just I'm just saying that's literally what the bad girls did before they got to do. Idea because 
That is. My, me and my buddy Marquise was writing a movie about um, kind of like a black exploitation film, like Iceberg Slim, but it was about mm -hmm. pimps and, and you know, but it was a lot of knowledge and game. But we was like, yo, it was a story of documentary of this old mm. school pimp, but it has so much knowledge in it. We was like, we could make a series and sell it on OnlyFans. You could. Because and uh, and you to subscribe for free and then charge them $9.99, $10.99 a month for every episode. I'm, Interesting. I'm, I'm just letting you know. Y'all spilling too much game on this live. Why y'all doing it? <laughs> I'm just letting you know. I, I can always cut this part out. Oh, he always <laughs> some Please friend. cut this part out. Yes, cut this. I, I can cut this part out, but I'm just letting you know. Like that's what that's what they did. They raised all that money on OnlyFans. Hey, oh, uh, Blueface had uh, a reality show on OnlyFans. He sure did. He did a little bad girl. Yeah. Who, who did that? Blueface, the rapper with the uh, tattoo on his face. Yeah. A lot of rappers have tattoo on their face. Yeah, that's true. Well, all of them. You know, yeah, y'all know the one where the girl got a tooth knocked out. He still ain't bought her a tooth. But yeah, yes, you right. Yeah, he killed Sean Rock. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> yes. <laughs> you talking about what's that? The one that went to jail, robbed his house, then they fell. He up. broke in his house. All that shit. They still together. It's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> So Not, this, like, they got together after that. Like, so, right, you, you're a real one. So just think about it. Can, consider it. So, um, well, let's see. Well, let, let me. So, so Dre, you got you, you got your music. You got your clothing line. Anything else we can expect to see from you from your storyline on the show? Um. Yeah. Film. Absolutely. Film. Man. The reality TV. That was. Would kind of birth my image to the world, man. I, I did three shows, and and that's why I came to Atlanta to put that energy in the film, and so they take me serious. And now I've been doing acting. I did my extra work for a few years, and we you gonna see me on that big screen for show, Storm. That is what's up. That's what's up, Trill. What can we expect from you on the show? Uh, I'm gonna be music music focused for sure. You know what I mean? That's that's my main thing right now. Um, I just got back from London shooting a music video out there, so it's definitely going to be music focused for me for sure. Nice. And Jalen, what about you? What can we expect to see from you? Drama, reality, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> yeah, life, real stuff. The real, real life going on with you, Jalen. <laughs> <laughs> Something I can relate to, you know, drama. <laughs> <laughs> and and now Prince. Cause you you are the drama prince. So what else can oh we expect God. from you? <laughs> <laughs> what else can we expect from Prince? I really want to showcase more of like the ball side of me. A lot of people don't get to see that I, I, I make a lot of moves behind the scenes, and I and I want people to focus more so on that. You know, my life is interesting enough, and I don't have no problem with sharing that. You know, but I really want to kind of focus more so on, you know, the ball side of me yeah. that people really don't get to see because I work really, really hard behind the scenes. So, yeah. Okay. So you want I'm them to see a, a different side versus what they saw years ago? Uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> okay. Gotcha. Yes. That, gotcha. Uh, that, that's my pass. I, I'm ready to move forward. Thank you, Prince. I feel I'm ready to move pass. forward. That's oh, Prince. Like, I think I think it's about time for we about to take over. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, everybody's like, let's move forward. Let's like, move <laughs> the world tries to keep you stuck in that bubble, man. And that's true. Right. Stuck for that's what right. for. And it's like, oh, it's Dre from Bad Girls. I'm like, yeah. I'm in the Tupac movie, ho. <laughs> like, Hello. You know, but that's how they know you. So I like what Prince said, man. We about to we about to repaint the canvas, man. Yeah. That's what's up. That's what's up. I love that. I love that. Oh, so I, sorry. Okay. By the way, I am doing a film. I'm doing a film. Okay. I will be playing a young version of Malcolm X, and I'm doing Ooh. a young version of Sam Cooke. So the transformation is going to be big. crazy, and I can't wait. And it will be on Amazon Prime. That's hard. That's okay. You make sure you drop hey. back now when that drop. So you cutting your hair? I had to say that. I had to. You gonna have to. I had to. You gonna have to cut your hair. Yeah, you gonna have to cut your hair. You gonna have to. How you gonna uh, play uh, Sam Cook? I can't say all of that, but you'll see. That's a hell of a wig <laughs> cap. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hell of a wig cap. That's all I can say. I don't know what you gonna do. Oh my god. <laughs> 
I'm, I'm just letting you know. I'm, I'm just saying. Look, so already, <laughs> look, they already grilled me about it. Trust me. We went over there. Oh, man. <sighs> it's going to be interesting. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see. Okay. <laughs> but before, before we head out, people, let everybody know where they can find you guys on your social media. So, Dre, let them know where they can find you. Uh, Dre P419 is my handle on everything. Um, made it out to mud.com is the brand. And Dre P419, man, all, all across the world. Let's go. What about you, Trail? Where can they find you? Uh, Trail Love, real name, no gimmicks. You know what I'm saying? Across all platforms. So that's T R E L L L O V E. Um, also, traillove.com, my official website. But yeah, look me up anywhere. You'll definitely find me for sure. What about you, Jalen? You know, it's Jalen Banks all over. Uh, Sometimes Jalen P. Whatever the they want to give me that day. Um, but yeah, Instagram, Facebook, you can find me on there. And Prince, where can they find you? At official Prince Carter everywhere. Yes, yeah, sir. Okay. All right. Everywhere. Fellas, thank you for joining me. I can't wait to see what we what we got coming with this show. <laughs> Y'all know I'm gonna be watching, like trying to see what's going on. And, hey, if you take my idea, Prince, I need that damn I, producer credit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. <laughs> okay, okay. Hey, Storm. <laughs> Yes. I got a question for you, man. For sure. Has anybody told you that your backdrop and shit look like Kevin Samuel shit a little bit? Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> I promise that wasn't on purpose. I promise. Storm. Oh shit. Oh, I'm shit. just saying. Wait a minute. Though. Wait. <laughs> I'm gonna make it worse. I, I took these off for y'all oh, came on. I didn't even want to uh, do that thing. <laughs> that, that'll really, yeah. Here we now, go. Believe it or not, I just got this set together like a couple weeks ago, and then yeah. he died. So people are gonna be like, "Did you copy that man's set?" Like, no, nah, I promise. I artwork, man. I love the art, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate yeah, it. It's well put together, my brother. Yo. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. I tell you what, this look. As long as you can see me, it's not Kevin Samuels. If I turn the lights off and put them lights in the background, them LEDs and shit. <laughs> oh my god! Then you'd be like, okay, come on now. Now you just really copy. Now so. come on now. <laughs> <laughs> but thank thank y'all for joining me. Um, anytime y'all got projects, man, come come on and stop by the show. Definitely right, so, man. Appreciate you for sure. Thank you for having us. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. Storm show. It's a storm show.